a warm greetings to my viewers i am pragya welcome you all to my channel today we will discuss about couple and examples of couple action in everyday life to understand the couple now let us have the idea for like parallel force and unlike parallel force this concept we will apply in couple and we will understand what is a couple and how a couple is formed so when we are talking about parallel forces like parallel forces so here it is said obviously two forces are acting parallel to each other so here when two or more forces act on a body rigid body uh, such that they act parallel to each other see i have taken two bodies f1 and f sorry i have taken two forces f1 and f2 acting in the same direction they act parallel to each other and uh, and are in the same direction here these two forces are acting in the same direction so obviously in the same direction if force is acting equal and opposite force you, you can say this one and body can move in one direction only okay and here let us see this is unlike parallel forces so when two forces act on a body such that forces are parallel to each other see these two are the forces which are parallel to each other f1 and f2 are parallel to each other but act in opposite direction to each other so here f1 and f2 this one is parallel but direction of these two bodies is opposite to each other now onwards when we will describe this couple we will go for this parallel forces okay unlike parallel forces we will discuss so one thing we are getting that if a body is pivoted and forces acting on the body if we want to rotate a body a single force is not a single force uh, on the pivoted body is not cause the body to move a single force a single force does not cause the single force uh, applied on okay so single force applied on a pivoted body on a pivoted body does not cause does not cause rot uh, cause any rotation does not cause any rotation of the body of the body so here single force it is not means enough to cause the body rotate so how many forces so at least two forces two forces are required to rotate a body minimum two forces are required um, to rotate a body to rotate a body okay so this concept we will see and we will go for the term couple fine couple two equal online and parallel forces whose line of action are not same constitute a couple here let me read again two equal online and parallel forces also you can say two equal and opposite force two equal and opposite forces whose line of action of force are not same constitute a couple if you don't write this line of action of force is not same then you will lose mark is not same is this is the most important point here just to explain you this one here let me take a body okay this body let me take this one this one i am taking let me take this body and here what i want to say i want to apply the force the same this is the line of action of force for me this is the line of action of force i am applying this this line of action of force in the same point okay so equal and opposite will the body will move no will the body rotate no if i will apply this this is the line of action of force is same but line of action of force is not same two equal and opposite forces apply so what will happen body will start rotating body will start rotating the same thing here what does it cause this the effect of couple 
it forms the rotational motion so we can write the effect of of couple is to produce is to produce rotational motion is to produce rotational motion about a point about a point so here let me take a body let me take this is the body and here this is pivoted somehow this is the pivoted body so here let me uh, um, this apply the force here it is applied the force here it is applied the force because we have we are talking about we are not talking about the same direction equal um, force we are talking rather we are talking about equal and opposite means two parallel forces opposite in direction so what happens each of the force this exert a turning effect on the same direction so this one will exert because we are talking about equal and opposite equal and opposite which means that one their magnitude is same same magnitude f1 the this magnitude of f1 is equal to magnitude of f2 but these two are in the um, this opposite direction so what happens here here this each of the force exert the turning effect in the same direction see if it is starting motion if it will be in this direction moving this body also will move in this direction if it is starting rotating in the clockwise if it will start in the clockwise both will have clockwise and if it is not both will have this anti clockwise motion okay so here the this this two means same direction and they do not cancel each other here just let me write this one each so this one is important each of the force uh, exert exert a turning effect here last class we have discussed about the turning effect so each one will about to turn here it is a pivoted point about it is a also uh, exert a turning turning effect in same direction in same direction in same direction they do not cancel each other they do not cancel each other they do not cancel each other okay so so body experiences 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 a rotational a rotational motion maybe in clockwise in clockwise or anti clockwise so it depends which side body will move whether it will move in the clockwise or it will move in the anti clockwise so i hope you understand this one if i am keeping a body here if this is it is pivoted if equal and opposite forces are applied body will start moving if it is if it is applied in this direction so body will start moving this side so it depends whether it will move clockwise direction or anti clockwise direction understand so here while writing the definition of couple don't forget to write uh, this uh, the not acting on the same line okay so here another point is that when and here when they are moving this is known as couple and couple action is formed so now let us take let this is the body one force is acting this side another force is acting this side obviously this is the um, this uh, distance between these two these two forces let it be f1 let it be f2 this is the distance between the two forces and here it is let it be pi forted and this, as it forms couple this arm is known as couple arm this arm is known as couple arm let it be ab it, this rotation is produced due to f1 and f2 so here it is the rotation produced is due to the force externally applied we are applying the force externally to produce the rotation and the force of reaction is produced at the pivoted point here we, we will get this um, reaction so every action has a equal 
and opposite reaction. So here it is action. So what will be the reaction? Reaction where will be the reaction? Reaction is at center or at the pivot, not exactly center, it is the pivoted point. So here what we can say, the moment of force of the reaction about the pivot point is zero because distance from this axis of rotation will be zero. So force of reaction at this point, it is, it is zero. So moment of couple, this is the body AB, it is pivoted at O, two forces equal and opposite. This one it is uh, F let it be because if I will take F1 and F2 also again I have to so that F1 is equal to F2. So let us better to write F. So here this body it see this body will start moving this direction. This one will start moving in this direction previous or previously now only we have discussed. Here, when the body in the couple, either body will move in the clockwise direction or anticlockwise direction. So, here body moves in that anticlockwise direction. So, let us find out moment of couple. Here, let us write down here moment of force F at A. Moment of force F at A. So, what it will be? Here F into OA. And direction, obviously this one it is anticlockwise. It is anticlockwise. Then, let me go for second. Here, moment of force. Moment of force. F at B. What it will be? F into OB. And its direction also anticlockwise. It is anticlockwise. It is anticlockwise direction. So total moment let us find out. Here total, total moment of couple let us find out is, is equal to what? This one is the moment of couple from here and this one also. Here what we can write? We can write F into OA plus F into OB. This FF is, com well, is equal. So for this let me write F let me take common. OA plus OB here OA plus OB if I will write this one arrange this I can write here AO plus OB I can write ultimately what I can write I can write here this one equal to is equal to A into B so what is AB this is the perpendicular distance between uh, perpendicular distance between these two ends uh, two forces so here this one, this forms the copular. Okay. So, here what we can represent. This one, if I will take this distance equal to D. You can take D, R, X, Y, Z, whatever it may be. But, this one, if this one, it is the copular. When you are writing D, before that one, you explain that D is copular. So, here we can write F into, F into D. So, moment of force. What we can write? Moment of force. Let me rub this one. So, moment of force. Sorry, moment of couple is, so moment of couple, moment of couple equal to either of the force, either force, magnitude of force, okay, into, into the perpendicular distance, distance between, perpendicular distance between two forces between the two two forces otherwise this per, this one also perpendicular distance between two or two forces we can write this one as also couple arm okay this one also can be written as couple arm so if we are going for this what will be its unit so its unit will be what will be its unit unit will be so here force it equal to Newton and here distance this equal to meter. So this unit is Newton meter. Moment. Application based question. Question is a body is acted upon by two forces equal in magnitude. Means uh, equal and opposite here. Uh, uh, state the effect of a force if both the forces act on the same point of the body. Okay. So let, let us see that here let it be the body. And force is acting here in this direction 
and here in this direction. So what we can say? This line of action of same, of line of action of force, both the forces is same. That is why here body resultant force equal to zero. In this case, when opposite equal and opposite, but line of action of force is same. So what we can write? Resultant force, resultant force is zero. Resultant force is zero. So body will not move implies body will not move will not move this one and interesting here see what what we are discussing so here we are taking the body let it be the same body i am taking this is this side force is applied here force is applied here this is the line of action of force this is the line of action of force they do not coincide obviously in this case body will start rotational motion Okay, so here we can write um, body will body will have this rotational motion. Here body will start rotating. Body will start rotating about the about the point or about the fulcrum or about the pivot. Commonly. Used means couple action. Examples of couple action. Turning the water cap. Tightening the cap of a bottle. Turning the st uh, steering of the car. Uh, turning the key in a lock. Uh, and uh, driving the pedal of the bicycle. The pair of forces is applied. Okay. Okay. First of all, let us see how these equal and opposite forces are applied. So now, let me take. Let me take this one. It is a ca water uh, cap. Type. okay so here if i want to open this one so what i have to do i have to see here i have to apply two equal and opposite direction force so here see this i am applying the force clear so when force is applied here like that force is applied let it be clear so two if i use one hand to open the type I, it cannot be possible so this one to equal and opposite. I have to turn this like, like this. If it is anti-clockwise, anti-clockwise. If it is clockwise, both will be in clockwise direction. Two forces, I am acting like this one. Okay. If I will go for another one, this um, cap of this uh, pen, if we want to, here also, see, here also, two equal and opposite forces is acting on the body. Clear? Then, if I will go for let it be this one is the steering of the wheel so here if i will apply so here this one so one force is applied in this direction another force is applied in this direction so two equal and opposite so that body can rotate body can move so an another one is the opening of the tap oh sorry opening of the water bottle So if I will take to open this one to water bottle here, I have to apply the force. Okay, two equal and opposite forces is acting on the body. Okay, I hope you understand this one. Thank you for watching.